I'm going to rotate my light just for ease of, I want to have a, a solid black shadow on that side of her face so you can see that she's going to just blend in to the background. So if I do this, light from the side, take a quick look here. Okay, so photographing her on a solid black background, because I have chosen to have the, this side of her face over here to go to shadow, it's solid black. She just blends right in, no separation. So there's a couple things we can do. So I can have her hold this from behind, and I'm going to have you hold it right there. And uh, if you don't have light contamination, which, oh, we talked about this yesterday, but um, this light is making it hard for me to see what the, the light is actually doing with the modeling lights. So I do have to take a bit of a test shot. But what I should be doing is kicking a highlight back to her. And can you hold it up a little higher? Great. OK. So watch the difference. This is with a silver reflector. Do before and after. It gives me separation. But it's nice and subtle. It's not super contrasty. But if you look at it, it is a little bit cooler than the rest of her skin tone. Silver cools things down, and she has a warm skin tone. So can you flip it around? Is it the silver gold on the other side? Yes. Great. So you can move in nice and close. Same exact angle for me. Great. So this is going to be more matching of her skin tones. And it's actually really, really obvious. The first photo, the highlight carving out her jaw, is very cool and blue. The second, it looks much more like her skin tone with a silver gold mix. So you have to flip back and forth kind of real fast to see that. Another thing that you can do as well is, can I get this around to the other side? Yeah. Will it reach? Yeah. OK. So I'll do that, and I'll grab another modifier. And the other thing I can do is introduce another light. So instead of having a reflector, I can bring another light source from behind and just light to give her some separation. In my studio, most of the time, I use these or some variation of these, and this, these are barn doors, because then I can close the leaf down so I can have just a very small highlight. Um, probably with darker skin tones, well, what I use in my studio is, um, okay, I'm gonna, this is like a very expensive thing, so it's gonna sound really snotty. Um, they're called strip lights. They're not strip banks, they're actually lights, but they have diffusion, but they're like, the little ones, like five grand. So I'm not going to really recommend that, but um, it's awesome because it doesn't. When I, I've used that when I'm photographing really dark skin tones because I can have that light source. It has barn doors on it, so I can close it down so it's really, really narrow beam. But it has a kind of bulbed um, diffusion on the outside, which means it's softer. So I don't have a lot of texture, but I can still have a nice, crisp, controlled highlight. So an alternative would be is you could use a um, strip bank, you know, one of the strip soft boxes. You could use a grid in it, and a grid focuses the light, so it'll give you a narrower beam. Or you could do what I used to do, which was black gaffer's tape, and <laughs> tape half of the soft box so it would be narrower. So you'd want something narrower if you just want a tiny highlight. And what's the... Uh... 4.5. Okay, that should be a little kick. We'll take a little kick of highlight here. And was I doing vertical or horizontal before? Okay. Okay. So this is why you'll be able to see instantly. This is why I was saying for the top of her head there, I wouldn't go with a silver reflector or barn doors like I might go with maybe with a lighter skin tone because the highlight gets overexposed more quickly. An option I have, can you rotate it and put the, or actually bring it down a little bit and put the barn door to block that off just a little bit. I'm going to try to cut that highlight out a tiny bit. Oh, I just looked at it, so I can't see anything. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. OK, let's try this. Um, can you turn it down just a tiny bit? Thank you. No problem. OK, great. So it's still a little hot, and that's, why, that's what I'm saying is if you have a strip bank, that would be preferable for th this skin tone.